PG&E crews replace power poles in Weimar, calling it critical safety and reliability work. I'm noticing that through this extreme heat event, excessive heat, the power was still being shut off. This Colfax customer is frustrated with losing power more than once. PG&E warned her with a letter saying crews need to replace a power pole. But this is not the right time to be doing it. Like other customers who received phone messages. Weather and other factors that affect safe working conditions may change our schedule. You may see contractor crews and equipment and hear noise during construction. They don't understand why the work is happening during a heat wave. This resident has been checking on her neighbors. I'm concerned for, for those that can't go somewhere um, and don't have a generator. Even if you do have a generator, running a fan isn't going to get you through an outage when it's 104, 106 outside. PG&E says Thursday's planned outages in Weimar impacted 42 customers and lasted six hours from 8 a.m. to 2.40. Crews completed 22 jobs called a mega bundle, which means they worked on various jobs at once to prevent future power disruptions. I understand unplanned outages happen, but now these planned outages, why do them under these conditions? It's just too hot. Several residents we spoke with say they understand the need for their work, just wait until the heat wave ends. I mean, I don't have any problem with the upgrades. I have no problem. Some of the customers tell us they've already received notices for more planned outages later this month. PG&E says the work is being done in 420 distribution circuit miles in locations with the highest wildfire risk. In Placer County, Michelle Bandur, KCRA 3 News. Thanks, Michelle. And we asked PG&E about moving the work to another day, but a spokesperson says it's hard to reschedule since they're working on several jobs at the same time. They did bring in extra crews to finish the work as quickly as possible, they tell us.